In a Sierra Leone jungle, tourists stumble toward help. A group of aggressive chimps escape from the Takugama primate sanctuary and are on a rampage. The problem started here, a tunnel to the sleeping den. But the tunnel has a redundant locking system. Usually, a timber stop and padlock secure each end. But somehow, a chimp manages to open both locks. Even with one lock down, there are still two more steel doors between the ape and escape. In an unbelievable coincidence, a cleaner accidentally leaves not just the second door open, but the third as well. With all three doors open, the entire troop of captive chimps storms out. They are led by the group's alpha male. His name is Bruno. Archival footage shows that he's extremely large and very powerful. He's the same chimp that attacks Gary Brown and his companions in the car before being chased off. The rest of the posse is screaming above Gary's head as he struggles to guide the wounded Melvin to safety. Their driver, Isakano, is missing and could be in danger. Nearby, one of the reserve's employees walks along the perimeter. He notices something on the ground. It's the body of Isa. These photos of chimps on the attack give us a glimpse of what probably happened to the driver. The apes gang up on their victim. They bite extremities, mutilate genitals. Issa suffered similar wounds. When a mob of chimps kills, it's not a quiet event. After Gary and Melvin fled the car, chimps were screaming on the hill above them. It's likely they were hearing the fatal attack on Issa. 